So once you get the Airhawk open, there are a couple of features that I would like to point out. We will start with the actual joystick. You can see the joystick is very, just as advertised, a single finger can operate the joystick. Either way, you have very simple controls on the joystick that I will go over once we get started here. The joystick itself, it's by default going to be mounted on the, the right side or the right arm. And of course, you can see how the arms of the Airhawk actually fold behind the unit themselves. You can see that the cord has about five prongs and it has a little ridge. And if you look at the joystick itself, well, before I go into the joystick, I'm going to show you the actual front of the Airhawk. So you can take a look inside here and you're just going to undo the little screw and you're going to just simply slide because you can see that there's a ridge on the bottom here of the joystick you're going to line it up make certain that there is enough tension to allow it to very easily slide in screw it in and you can see even though I'm trying, that joystick is very secure. To look at the other side here, you have five pins and you have another ridge inside of the five pins. I don't know how well you can see it here, but if you very simply line the two of those up, it just snaps right together. You might need to pull right here just a slight bit and there is a slight cap that comes apart and screws everything together. Once the joystick is on, I want to make certain that everybody understands that your chair here, you can see that the wheels are locked. These red buttons right here will make this a neutral chair just simply by sliding them forward. The chair is in manual mode at this point. So if you turn the joystick on when the chair is in manual mode, it's not going to operate. It's not going to go anywhere. You would just want to make certain that those levers are back so that the motor is engaged and very simply you could either mount in the front of the chair or you could do very easily a sideways mount getting in the chair and we're going to focus on the joystick it's as simple as pressing the green button the battery has been pre-charged the airhawk is ready to roll it has a horn built in and you can see that that is currently on the lowest speed setting however I can very easily turn the speed setting up I will caution you against doing so we're in a small office here that you can see and what I'm going to do is demonstrate literally how this chair on its lowest setting does a perfect 360, handles phenomenal with zero complication. What I would suggest is that when you are getting used to and as you are getting used to the joystick and the Airhawk power wheelchair, which very easily reverses, which very easily goes diagonal, you can see how quickly it stops because of the electromagnetic brakes and true to the advertising, you can literally operate the Airhawk folding power wheelchair with just a single finger. I would advise to start slow prior to giving it more juice 
and at that point you can understand that the chair has a substantial amount of power and juice which we will demonstrate in future riding videos.